Hey guys, how are you guys doing? Now, I'm going to be doing a video here, a um, little bit different from usual, but it's basically what's going to be happening in the sky within the next month. Within the next month, folks, we're going to witness some heavenly events. We're starting tonight. We're actually going to have a full moon and a blood moon um, lunar eclipse. We're going to have a full moon event tonight, followed with a blood moon lunar eclipse. This will be seen mostly in uh, places like Canada, Europe, uh, Mexico. Uh, most of the Western world will get to see this red um, lunar eclipse. It also will be a full moon because the moon tonight will be 14% larger than its normal size, okay? What that means is actually at this point in time, the moon is a little bit closer to our planet, okay, folks? But not only a full moon, folks, we're also going to get a um, blood moon uh, lunar eclipse. The moon is going to look bloodshot red. Also, folks, this month we're going to have a, what um, astronaut dubbed as the comet of the century. Yes, the comet will be, there's going to be a huge comet passing Earth. This will be visible from September 27th to the last week of October. Once again, September 27th, you'll, uh, you, you're going to be able to see a comet with the naked eye. You don't, you're not going to need a telescope from September 27th to the last week of October, folks. All right. The brightest this comet will be is on October 2nd. You got to remember these dates, folks. October 2nd. All right? That's the brightest the comet is going to be. And just to have a little, add a little caveat to that, on October 2nd, we're going to have the Ring of Fire Eclipse. Yes, folks. On October 2nd, second of this year we're going to have another eclipse remember that we have an eclipse on april 8th that was visible mostly in the western world especially here in north america now this eclipse will be visible the only american the only american territory that will see this eclipse is hawaii because they're the closest to the ring of fire places like japan indonesia Japan, listen, remember these places, Hawaii, you guys are going to get a lot of quakes in the next month. This is just the beginning. After October 2nd, these places that are, that are actually going to see the eclipse are going to be rattling with earthquakes. And I'm going to list them off. The only U.S. territory that will see the Ring of Fire eclipse on October 2nd is Hawaii. Hawaii, you guys are in trouble. Places like Japan will see it you're in trouble with earthquakes. Indonesia, we'll see you're in trouble with earthquakes. Chile, you're in trouble with earthquakes. You will also see it. Um, um, uh, Guam, you're going to see it. Uh, places like, um, um, I'm, I'm trying to think here. Uh, Mexico will also see, um, see a little bit of it. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm trying to think. New Zealand, will also see the uh, the eclipse. Um, what I'm trying to say here, folks, is that these places that I'm, I'm listing off, they will have, some will see the eclipse a lot better than some. But these are the places that are closest to the ring of fire. And you guys are in trouble. The earthquakes that come in your way is going to rattle, shake, and it's going to destroy a lot of your infrastructure. Guys, once again, man, you saw what happened with the earthquakes that started in New Madrid after April 8th, after that eclipse. The same thing is coming for the Ring of Fire eclipse. But hear me out now with my prediction. 
it's going to be 10 times worse. This eclipse, the ring of fire eclipse and the earthquake that it's going to bring with it after October 8th is going to be 10 times worse than after the, the earthquake from the eclipse from April 8th, 2024. All right, guys. So there's going to be three heavenly events happening within the next month. I list them all. I go over it again. We're going to have a full moon tonight on September 17, 2024. The full moon will also be a blood moon e lunar eclipse. All right, guys, the moon will look blood shot red. Not everyone will get to see this. North America, you guys will get to see this. Places in Europe, places in Mexico, Canada, you guys will also get to see this. But not everyone is going to see the, 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 the blood moon, folks. This is event number one for the sky. Event number two, Comet of the Century will be visible from September 27 to the last week of October. All right, guys, it's a huge comet. It will be, it, this comet will be the brightest on October 2nd. You're not going to need telescope to see this. And on, on October 2nd, you're going to have the Ring of Fire lunar eclipse that's going to bring a ton of earthquakes with it. And Japan, you guys are going to get the bulk of it. All right. Japan and Indonesia, the bulk of this. So once again, folks, I'm just trying to make you guys aware, letting you know what's coming, letting you know what's happening. I'm not trying to spread fear, none of that, even though I will always get this on my video. Making you guys aware is half the battle. That is just my philosophy. And that's what I'm here for, folks. I hope this information helped and I hope it helps someone, but you can look into it for yourself. Starting tonight, we're going to start seeing some extremely unusual seismic activity and keep your eyes in the sky. It's going to get really weird and the chaos on our planet Earth is just getting started. Thank you guys. Enjoy your day. Thank you for watching my video. And once again, folks, I have joined Twitch. So go ahead and follow my Twitch account. All right. Please do. I share the link. So share it. I'm going to be doing a lot of live streaming.